Miss Rhodes. Yes, Mr. Vandergelder. Once we're in the air, I'll want coffee. They have flight attendants for that. I like it when you get me coffee. Yes, Mr. Vandergelder. And Miss Rhodes, I just finished reading my speech that you wrote. I don't like it. Would you uh, please redo it and make more references to me and to my tremendous commitment to the women's movement? <laughs> yes, Mr. Vandergelder. God, I hate him. I'd like to punch him right in the middle of his fat face. <laughs> Miss Rhodes. Yes, sir? Once we're in New York, would you uh, pick up a little gift for my wife? Yes. Perhaps a picture of you and your old army buddy. <laughs> How are you doing over there, Fluffy? How am I doing what? <laughs> Start spreading the news. <laughs> now, what do you think, Peg? Do we live in that VIP lounge or what? Oh, well, probably not. He threw us out after you overflowed the toilet. <laughs> oh, Peg, you gotta see this. Look at those poor slobs back in coach sitting like cattle. Now, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. well, that's not nice. Boy, the seats are big up here in first class. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mars. <laughs> You check out the old guy sitting next to his granddaughter over there. <laughs> oh, Peg, come on. She's probably just his personal flotation device. Excuse me, sir. Please buckle your seatbelt. Excuse me. Is the pilot any good? Oh, he's fantastic. <laughs> His hands are gentle, but oh, so rough. <laughs> I meant, can he fly the plane? How would I know? <laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is your captain, John Canyon. That's it? No, have a pleasant flight? No, we won't crash? No, Marcy Rhodes is not going to die? Hey, Mars, you're a little loud over there. Now, listen, you're flying first class. Let's act like you've done this a couple of times before. Hey, waitress! <laughs> Sir, we have some complimentary in-flight slippers, if you'd care to take off your shoes and relax. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, stewardess, go around for everybody. I mean, it's free up here, isn't it? <laughs> Ta, feeling better, honey? Fine, fine. Not dead or anything. I told you that gypsy fortune teller was just a bunch of hooey. This is your captain speaking. We're starting our initial descent over... Whoa! Frank, turn off the intercom. We're going down. What are we going to do? You know I stink at landings. You took the test for... Give me some gin and turn the intercom back on. I'll just lie to the passengers. <laughs> uh, we're encountering a little mild turbulence. So for your safety, fasten seatbelts, extinguish all cigarettes, and... Uh, what the hell? Light up. <laughs> Peggy! This is it! We're going down! Hey, hey, Paula, I want to marry you. Hey, hey, Paul, I want to marry you, too. 